Hello, this is Luger74, and today I'm going to be showing you how to get music off of MySpace using Audacity for Windows 64-bit and 32-bit users. So stay tuned and learn how. Alright, the first main step is download Audacity. I will include a link on the sidebar, and when you click on it, it should look like this. You find your operating system and you download. Once it is installed on your system, you're going to want to go to the next link I'll provide for the lame mp3 encoder. And what this lets you do is export mp3 files with Audacity. This is very important if you want to listen to the songs or you want to include them in a video in an mp3 format. You download it. Once it's finished downloading, you should double click it and it'll automatically put it into Audacity. Once that step is done, open up Audacity. It should look just like this. And as you can see, I cannot change my output or input settings. And most Vista users will have this problem because their devices do not allow them to change those settings. But you can go to Edit and Preferences, Audio, Input, and Output to change it. You leave Playback alone, and Recording by default should be a Microsoft Sound Mapper or a default device that you have set. You're going to want to change it to a record playback option. And the channels will be mono. You press OK. And now I will show you a demonstration of me recording a song off JTRO's music channel on MySpace. You simply press record and you press play and it will record everything coming out of the speakers. Please watch. Now you see, I press stop, and it started stopped recording. Your next part, and also make sure you listen to the end of the song, and then press stop so you have the full song. You can also go to the beginning, and trim it by highlighting it like that, and then press control X. Now it's more of a music file. Next, to export it as an mp3, you're going to want to go to File, Export as MP3. Your tracks will be mixed down into a single mono channel to in the exported file. You press OK. You click the destination. Uh, let's name it LOL. And you press Save. Now, you're going to want to do the more flexible option. Here you can put a title, an artist, and an album. Just leave all this down here alone unless you know you want to mess with it. Press OK. And ta-da! Lame is now exporting it. You can exit, you can save the project if you want or not. I just choose no because I already have the MP3. Let me close those tabs. And it should be right here. You can also drag it into iTunes or whatever you want. So, very easy to do. Just listen to me do the steps. And I hope you enjoy your new music. And uh, thank you for watching. Please leave a comment. If you have any troubles, please rate, subscribe. And also, if you would like a more personalized message, just message me with any complaints or if you have any trouble working my method. Thank you for watching. And uh, I'm going to head off to bed. It's uh, almost 5 a.m. in the morning. Thank you for subscribing, guys. Good night. New kid on the block, the grind, it will never stop. Holding it down right here on 106 and part of good life. Still jamming music even after dark. Please pardon me, but I'm about to get a whole part.
I'm becoming stars, so that means I'm a big thing. Big dreams, they be the kid had sweet dreams, rocking all the name brand wearing all the new things. Yeah, and yeah, it's so exciting. My fans really love me, and yes, they really like me. Oh yeah, and my haters don't like it. Oh yeah, I'm a hero in a sidekick. So bright, so bright.